Like a blast from the past, card collecting is in again. When the pandemic brought live sports to a halt last year, sports fans used the internet to explore their own collections before restrictions were lifted for in-person events. In Berlin, clutch cards and collectibles is proof of this trend, only founded this year. For owner Marco Giannoni, this venture with a childhood friend is a dream come true. We've been collecting cards since we were little kids. I mean, even when we were uh, in elementary school, we even in our yearbooks said we wanted to be card collectors someday. Our idea was to kind of create just like a museum where people could come in and things could be for sale. Rookie and prospect cards like these are popular items for collectors who are just starting out. They've got a low price point and if that player becomes a star, that card could be worth a lot of money. But if you're looking to drop some serious change, well, here's the most expensive item in this store. A Pokemon card from 1999, valued at $15,000. Packs with multiple cards can cost hundreds. But why spend so much money on something that can fit in your pocket? A lot of our collectors enjoy actually the physical touch of having something and admiring it, taking it home. And it's almost like modern day art. So basically, um, people look at you know our first edition Charizard the same way you look at a, a high-end painting as like the Mona Lisa. So if something really catches your eye or you just want to have a little fun, card collecting is a great way to stay in the game. Whether you want to spend $1 or $10,000, we have a little bit of everything. Feel free to come in, ask. You know, education is important about the hobby, but there's a little bit of something for everybody. In Berlin, Unqua Sonye, Fox 61 Sports.